Bye. 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 I'm back in Kalispell and I need the meats. Still mad about Mudman Burgers and the abuse that happened there. A brief rundown. Mudman was a non-profit burger place in Kalispell that possibly had the best burger in Montana. Apparently the best burgers are made with the tears of missionaries. Allegedly there was slave labor, i.e. internships, stolen wages, long hours, and the founders Mike and Pam Rozelle being generally jerks but they had a darn fine burger. Enter Frugals, a chain with no relationship to the former, and whose only values being the desire to make money. No altruistic goals or empathetic ideals for me to be disappointed in. Frugals is making the world a better place by feeding me. Get a half pound double cheeseburger, uh, with fries and a Pepsi with that, and that'll be everything. Have coke, is that okay? That'll be fine. Get a double cheeseburger with a regular fry and a coke. That'll be 867 at the window. Got my frugals here. And I've got the frugals. And as I said, only Coke. I do prefer Pepsi, but I can't knock it against them. We're here for burgers. I was ordering 129. Let's have a look at what Frugals can offer here. Fries, and yes, it's in a car. I'm parked in a car, or truck, whatever, um, here, because this is a drive through only facility. There's nothing inside to show you, but I could show you these fries. All right, the fries are, I think these are average Food Service of America fries, I think. That's my guessing. Food Service of America, generic fries. And of course I can't eat them with ketchup because I'm in my truck. Shouldn't even be eating in here anyway. Try not to turn this into a Tundra review, but this thing is huge. Which, um, when you're eating in the truck, makes a problem. Because, yes, I'm showing you a picture of my crotch. But the seats are so huge that um, if you should drop anything here, it ends up right here. Makes a terrible stain on the seat. Or, or not. I try not to eat in the truck too often. Instead of a, a regular seat where you're, you're sitting and it would just fall straight to the ground. And you would yeah, pick it up later. But the crux of it. I ordered the double cheeseburger, which I am told is a half pound. Ooh, I'm liking where this is going. It feels like it could be a half pound. Yes, I can smell it. All right, average bun. I mean, that's an average food service bun. Um, but the patty, that's not a handmade patty, I don't think. Not a handmade patty. I look down in here. Yeah, it's food services of America. Um, we have that shredded lettuce, which I'm not really a fan of. I really like the, uh, the iceberg non-shredded lettuce. We got pickles. We got some uh, sauce up in there, ketchup, cheese in between the patty. Now we are fucking. I've had frugals before. You've got to get the full experience. Fries, yeah. This is the best drive through burger you can get in Montana. The best. The Roadhouse has a drive through. Now I'm going on um, meat patty texture. Although. I said it was pre-portioned, so they come in a box and they put it put them out. I'm I'm guessing this is never frozen beef. It has that look and feel. It, it's like you get kind of that same taste from a Wendy's burger. This is a few steps above that. Now this fries, they've got a fry sauce. Well there you go. The best drive-through burger you can get. Knockout. You win. Thanks for watching. This is where I ask you what you think. Is there a better drive-through burger that I am not aware of? 
While you are down there commenting, be sure to like and subscribe.